Okay. Chapter 17, the guild's crew. It's your boy, Cass and Corral, here back playing Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky. We just went through a dungeon to steal time gear, but time was stopped when we entered the deep part of the forest, and yeah, at the end, Groval went to get other time gears, and we decided to, or Revan and Nichigo decided to go into the guild to tell everyone their experience. So, let's continue. Here you are, each go. We like tough skilled. Feels like we haven't been here in a long time. You damn right. But now that we're here, it feels kind of awkward to go in. After all, we did vanish in a front in front of everyone in a mysterious way. It would be sort of awkward, even embarrassing to walk in out of the blue. No, we can't go acting. We can't go around acting embarrassed now. We have to see everyone and tell them the truth. Okay, I'll stand above the sentry post. Pokemon detected, Pokemon detected. Whose footprint, whose footprint? The footprint belongs to... The footprint belongs to... That's wrong, Diglett. Respond, respond. Manny? Hey, Diglett. Where do you think you're burning off to? That, that footprint. It's Reverend. Nanny? What? Nani? Hey, it is Reverend. And you go too. Dicklet. Long time no see. Whoa, what's that? Hey, hey, it's true. That's the floor's light. Oh my gosh, it really is each and Reverend. You're both alive. I'm worried about you so much. Ah, ah, I was... My god. And everyone... Home. Welcome home, Reverend. Need to go? Nanny? What was that again? Just... Just hold on for a moment. Let me get the story straight. Okay. And let me summarize the story so far. First, Groval is actually a good Pokemon. And he was collecting the Titan Gears to save the world. Yep. And the Great Dustmore only pretended to be kind and helpful. He was actually a heinous looking villain. Yep. Though I didn't really phrase it as heinous and wicked. Also, Ichigo was really Groval's partner. Yep. So Dustmore wanted to get rid of both Ichigo and Groval. So he took him to the future? Yep, and me too. Then you managed to escape from Dust Noir by the skin of your teeth. You barely made it back from home from the future. Mm hmm And finally, this planet will soon become paralyzed. And prevent to prevent that, Groval has started gathering the time gears again. Meanwhile, you two are looking for a place called Hidden Land. Is that your story in its full entirety? Yep, that's all of it. Heh heh heh, Reverend and Nichigo. You must have had a bad dream or something. Nah? Huh? Why don't you two just go to your room and get some rest? Now hold on a second. Are you actually accusing us of lying? Maybe. I mean, this is one hell of a story. What we told you is all true. I'm sure, I'm sure. I'm sure you two are suffering from exhaustion. A good nap will fix that. That's not it, Chetot. Please believe us. We're not lying. That's quite enough. So tell me, is there any part of your story that's even remotely plausible? A place called the Hidden Land? I'm the head of intelligence here, and I heard of no such place. And besides, the Great Dust Noir is far too kind to do anything you've alleged. Well, yes, I can't believe the truth about Dust Noir either. It's a huge shock. It was really hard to accept. But... I'll eat no more of this. I don't care what you say. The great Dust Noir, the villain, that's simply unbelievable. Seriously, don't you two feel the same way? How can anyone seriously think of the great Dust Noir as a villain? We hold Dust Noir in high esteem. We cannot believe it. See? See? 
be. Everyone shares the same opinion. But... What is it, Sunflora? There's one thing I don't understand. At the time, when the Great Dust Noir was about to return to the future... Dust Noir did to them. It was strange. Any way you look at it. Really? Do you think so? You don't don't you think that Reverend Angico fell into its dimensional hole by accident? No way. Dust Noir grabbed Reverend Angico and yanked him in. Hey hey, that's right. It looked that way to me too. What happened was really weird. Gosh. I really had to wonder why Dust Noir had to do something like that. If what Reverend said was true, then what Dustnoir did suddenly makes perfect sense. Nanny? Wait a minute. So, is that what you think now? Are you actually saying that you now believe that, or believe what Reverend and Ichigo are claiming? Well, what's your answer? Ah, uh, I believe them. Nanny, what did you say? So, beat him. You now claim that the Great Dust Noir is a villain? Oof. Golish. I really did think highly of Great Dust Noir. The whole idea sounds troubling when you put it that way. There's something more important here. Yup, yup. Ichigo and Reverend are more important. That's why. I believe what Ichigo and Reverend have to say. But Nani? But Bidoof. Hey, hey, I believe too. Oh my gosh, me too. There are Killed to colleagues after all. Oh, Cordfish and Sunflora. I believe them. Me too. So do I. Casting doubt on our colleagues is wrong. Trust is a must. Yeah. Squa. Thank you, everyone. Thank you for believing in us. Well, hiya. Sounds like we all agree. Huh? We all believe our friends. That's great. Then let's begin searching for the hidden land. Whoa, just hold on there, Guildmaster. Hmm? What's wrong? We're not all in agreement yet, are we? Huh? We're all good with the story. I suspect that Chatot isn't convinced. Oh, is that all? You don't need to worry about Chatot. Huh? Chatot is convinced, right? Hmm? Because Chata believed Reverend's story all along. Right, Chata? Eh. Yeah, yeah. Ah, he's breaking down. How peculiar. Well, good Mel, Guildmaster, there's no fooling you. I admit it. Yes, I believe each gun and Reverend break from the start. Ah, really? But if I would have said that I believed him right away, everyone would have just gone along with what I said. What's all of this? That's why I was so contrary. I want to put our adventure to the test. Gosh, life and story. But without a doubt, I was convinced from the get-go. I knew everyone, but surely believed our colleagues. There's you. Heh. <laughs> Heh. Ichigo, Reverend. I believe you. You're in good friends and guild membership. Or my good friends, whatever. Now listen, everyone. Time is stopping in more and more places. From Roman's story, our world is in danger. That means we have to do something. This is our time. In the name of Wiggly Tough's guild, we'll combine all our efforts. Discover the hidden land. Let's do this, everyone. Hoorah! Final chat talk. Yes, sir. Okay, everyone. Now on, we're shifting all our efforts into locating the hidden land. We also have to let everyone know what is happening to our world. Yeah, it's going to be... It's going to get busy. We're all... We'll all have to work hard. I sure will. I'll put it down to Treasure Town. Get the word out by Gaul. I'll go too. We have to let Azolf and his friends know too. If you're back at your legs, let me just try to stop Grovile. Hey, hey, I'll go... Then I'll go tell them. Okay. Everyone else... 
search for the hidden plant, please. Yeah. We do self learn others. Once your errands are done, get info on the hidden land. Yes, sir. Okay. Yunta. Hura. Alright, let's show some guts. Hey, hey, hey. I'm sorry that I don't have any info on the hidden land. Maybe. So I sparkle the town elder may know something. Sparkle the town elder. That would be the wisest and oldest Pokemon of Trainer Town. He loves the hot spring, so he's always there. In fact, I'm positive that you'll find him at the hot spring. Oh, I remember. Yeah. Or maybe we got blasted shit from that waterfall thing. <sighs> it's him. It's that nice old Pokemon we met. You should put his years of wisdom to use. Quest Corp took off the advice. I think we got to the hot spring the first time through the waterfall cave, each go. Let's go off. Off to the hot spring. But first, it's getting late, and besides, you must be hungry. Huh? Stomp growled. Aha, <laughs> yours did too. We should have dinner. And get a good night's sleep. Can all get to work tomorrow. Hey, each goat's belly growling again. Oh, did everyone hear that? What a laugh! When your belly barked back at Trimaco, huh? The laughing emoji. Very nice. Okay. All the same, but has the same whatever. Lovely night. It's been a while since we've been in this room. It feels as though I'm finally home. You know, I'm glad everyone believed our story. Got a little emotional over it. Let's go meet Twerkle tomorrow and talk with him. Get back at it tomorrow, Ichigo. Damn right. Right, next morning. Yay. Back to this shit. Uh huh, I'm so wrapping up. Everyone's aware of their duties today. Ah, uh, golly, yes. I'm hungry, so. I'm all ready to go. Good. Those of you investigating the hidden land, and those of you spreading the word about the true state of affairs, I expect you to organize your teams accordingly and get going. Let's get right to it, everyone. Hoorah! Let's go to the hot spring and get info from the wise old Torco. I think we have to get to the waterfall cave to get to the hot spring. Then let's make our way there. Alright. Can I do jobs if I want to? Oh my god, what is that about? Not Bristol. Save my beloved, no. Oh, there's a minute. Uh, you know what? Why not? Even though it's gonna be... It's gonna be 13th floor. Alright. Alright, let's see how our team is. Alright, um... Just game wall again? Ah, you. Going to team. Oh, it's level 3? Interesting. Burma? Hmm. Although... You know, let's have Baldo with us. Hopefully I don't need just three members, or I only have to bring... God, I hope I don't have to just bring... God, what am I trying to say? I hope I don't have to bring another, oh, another client with me, because I want my two 
I've never seen with them. Yeah, let's do some extra shit on this side because, of course, why not? Hey! Accepted him, even though I didn't think about it. Ah, eh, fine. I'm gonna call you. Uh, I think I'm gonna call you Gaffer. No, not Gaffy. Gaffer. There you go. You go chill out. Another shroomish. That absolute sad face. Hey yo. This game really knows I'm trying to go somewhere. Wow. Oh. Did I ever tell you that the last episode we got uh wake up slap? Well if I did. There you go. Oh my god. Hey! Alright, here you silly man. Oh, there you go. Finally. It's not like last episode where finding the stairs took so many. Access, I guess. There's a can come. Nice. Dead end. Oh, what? It's so alive. I don't know why the. But... Whatever the other thing's called. Oh, hey. Secret Bizarre we go! Oh yes. Well, since we're here, might as well do this. I'll just speed it up because it'll take the time. Nice. Uh, let's get ourselves a grab bag. Oh shit. There you go, holy cock. Another orange bear, how epic was that? The licky tongue will clean stuff and... The sh... Greninja, or... Sheninja? However you pronounce his name. Will have... can help you escape the dungeon. Oh no, I cringed. Oh, come on. Wow. 
tricks. There you go, finally. Sad. Wow. Okay, yo. Hey. Right. One more. Oh no, two more floors. Okay. Fine, yeah. Hello. I about this. Oh my god. What a motherfucker. Okay. Hey. Oh, hey, oh, gas goon. You stay there. Why is your thing big? You only have two items on sale as well. Dumbass. Okay. One more. There you go. Very happy. Very happy. Oh, Bonsley. Bonsai, Bonsai, whatever. Yeah, Bonsai, okay. He somehow missed. Oh, okay. Right on. So we're finding Minute, right? Okay, okay. Oh, no. There you go. Thank you so much. Okay, yeah, let's leave. Nice. Ah, thank you for rescuing Minim. Please accept this. Green gummy, oh yeah. Lovely. Okay. Ah, right. Back into the groove. Oh boy. Thank you. Uh, I forgot to start recording, but uh, no one has any clue where the hidden land, land is yet, so today we're gonna be. Or this time we're gonna be. I, of course, going to... The Waterfall Cave? Yes, it is Waterfall Cave. Okay. Can I bring my friends along? Or no? Hey. I wonder how easy this is going to be. I feel like it's going to be a little bit... More no payo. Oh no. Um. Yeah, I don't think the Pokemon have been leveled up. I guess you can say. Hey. Gotta do this easy shit. And the ca uh, caverns are smaller, yeah? Damn it. Hm. Alright. Yeah, back to the Pinkman esque music. I don't know how Absol got fucking lost. Absolutely don't get one for real. Oh boy. Thank you. Hey. No, I don't accept your thing. Miss Barboach. How dangerous. Oh, shit. Yeah. Come on. Oh, hey, oh. Mm -hmm. 
Oh boy, much more. Come on, whooper. Get out of here. Thank you. Right. There's ten floors only here, right? I think that's the case. It's not that long of a dungeon. Hey up. Oh ho! So many close stairs. I'm happy about that. Right. Oh hey. Cringe. Right, oh. Oh, load sad, hello. Thank you. Oh, Orenberry. Hmm. Nothing yet. Mm -mm. Oh, Ayo. Grimer. Why is Baldo getting hurt? Is there an item that he equips that makes his damage go a l up a little bit? Oh, but he takes some damage. Isn't this just a? Isn't this just below where he was? Where he spawned in? All right. Oh, absolute damage. Oh, hey. Much cash. Hello. Haven't seen you before. And you're gone already. How sad. Four eight. Hmm. Oh, whoa, okay. Think well, you're weak. Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't want to twist band, damn it. Thankfully, there's the exit right there. Hee <laughs> hee. Hey! Oh, okay. Fine. Uh, no, don't turn yet. <clears throat> I bet so. Hmm. Alright, hello, Torkoal. Hmm? Oh, yeah, my young friend. Come to wash away your exhaustion? Oh, not so. I see. You seek my wisdom. Oh, there's no better place than this to share your story. Ah, I see. The Hidden Land, you say? I have heard of it. Oh, really? The Hidden Land is truly a place of legend. It is tattered lore at best, handed down by oral tradition. No matter. Please tell us. Of course. I can tell you only what I heard. The Hidden Land lies beyond the sea, in a hidden place. So the story goes. The Hidden Place? Yes. The Hidden Land allows only the Chosen to find it go there, you one must possess certain qualities. Oh. A place that only someone with proper qualifications can go to. Okay, Torkoal. What are those qualifications? They are. Eh. Mm. Now, what were they? Oh boy, Boomers. Yeah, Boomer has lost his memory on that. I'm sorry. It slipped my mind. Oh no. Can't remember? Please, Torkoal. Please remember, this is really important. It's for you to say, but... Mm, uh, oh, that's it. You need proof. You need proof of some sort. Yes, that was it. Proof. Proof. What kind of proof? That would be... Oh, boy. Forgive me. I've gone again. I uh, can't remember. I, I'm sorry to disappoint you. Alright. Can you recall anything else at all? No, that's all. Give me youngsters. 
If I recall what proof you need, I'll be sure to let you know. Yes, please. Thank you, Torfum. Let's go back to the guild, let you go. Hmm. So Torkel couldn't provide us with many answers. That's too bad. Oh, that's not entirely true. You know that we need proof. And knowing that is step forward. Right? Hey, hey, we're searching too. Yeah, but we didn't find anything. But, there's no giving up. We have to keep trying, by golly. I'll keep trying to... We should have dinner and rest up for the night. We'll resume our efforts tomorrow. Oh, well, thanks everyone. Alright. Skip the thing, the dinner scene. Good night. Lovely moon. Ah, things aren't going as well as we'd hoped. When we talked with Torkel, I thought we had hope. I wonder who Groval is doing. Has he gathered the time gears? You have to hurry too. And there's no point in getting all worked up, especially since everyone is helping out. We should get some sleep. And start a fresh effort tomorrow. Okay, Ichigo, good night. Next morning. Oh boy. Hmm. Ahem. So, in short, the hidden line remains shrouded in mystery, but we're not giving up. Hoorah! Let's get out there and investigate again today. Let's go, everyone. Hoorah! Again. Where should we go investigate today, Ichigo? But we already talked to Portal. I don't know where to look next. Pokemon detected. Pokemon detected. Whose footprint? Whose footprint? The footprint belongs to... Torkoal, the town elder. Okay. What? Torkoal is here? Hmm. Duh. I cut up with you. Putting up this guild is hard on these old bones. What brings you here, dear Torkoal? Did you maybe remember something? Indeed I did. But I... Re I've recalled only one more tiny thing, sorry to say. Yesterday, I contemplated the waters of the spring for a long time. Finally, one recollection surfaced. But, it really is something small. I worry if it would be even more small to with you. Not a worry. Maybe a little bit of information helps, however small. Please say it. Say it. When we spoke of travel to the hidden land yesterday, I said that you need proof of your qualification to go there. I remember a little bit more about that proof. The proof, proof bears an inscription of a certain pattern. A certain pattern. Hey, hey, so what kind of pattern would that be? Hmm, how can I describe it? It's difficult. I can tell you that the pattern is quite intricate and odd. It's a peculiar, peculiar pattern. The kind of pattern you rarely see. Golly. Uh, you'd think I could think of something. But trying to think of such a thing. It's not easy when one tries. What could it be? The kind of pattern you rarely see. What could a pattern like that look like? A pattern you rarely see. A peculiar. Wait a second. A peculiar pattern. Uh huh, I remember that time. That's it. The relic fragment was inscribed with a peculiar pattern. Hmm? What is it, Ichigo? Pardon? My relic fragment? Oh, right! That pattern! Excuse me. Could you have a look at this, please? Oh! Th this is it! A pattern exactly like this! Nanny? Where, where did you get this? Um, I can't... Say if I even remember where. I just happened to pick it up. Yippee, this is fabulous. His reverend has this. Doesn't mean the reverend is qualified to go to the hidden land? That I wouldn't know. Maybe yes, maybe no. Go to the hidden land. One must surely possess that proof. It doesn't necessarily mean that the bearer of the proof really possesses the qualifications to be chosen. 
that the proof may be merely the physical t key to the hidden land. Even before that, though, that shares the same inscribed pattern. There's no sure connection between this relic fragment and the hidden, fra hidden land. Oh, but there's no question that this pattern has something to do with the hidden land. No, that is a lot. I suppose so. Wait, you do realize that the hidden land is only spoken in legend, right? You're surely not trying to find it a hidden land. Yes, we are. My goodness, what a surprise. Chat dot, this pattern. We've seen this pass somewhere, haven't we? Nani? Yes. It's the inlet to the northwest. Inside Brian Cave. Guildmaster, that place. Yes, I know. The vicious bandit was there. A vicious... bandit? By golly. Everyone, please listen. I saw this pattern... the same pattern deep inside a place called Brian Cave. I think we can discover more by taking the relic fragment there. However, there's one problem. The Pokemon lurks there. Who is a vicious bandit? Hey, hey, we're not about to let that scare us. Aren't we explorers? We all need to be brave. Thanks, everyone. But that place is challenging. Everyone should take time today to get ready. We'll set up for Brian Cave tomorrow. Hoorah! I thought that the hidden land was nothing more than folklore. Getting old has made my thinking so inflexible. That's very sad. This all makes me remember the day I dreamt of one of my sort of adventure. Help me see my dreams again. Do your best. Ho ho ho. Oh, look at you go. Yep, you can count on us. Thank you, Torko. Oh, it's nothing. Ho ho. Alright. Okay, spend the rest of the day getting ready. Okay, dismissed. Hoorah! Yup, yup, we'll get ready by golly. Ah, right. Chat Todd? You said to kill tomorrow on standby. Yo, kill, Master? Forgive me if I'm out of line, but please let me go to Brian Cave. Nope. Can't let you. Face danger like that ever again. That's why. That's why I must go. Please take me to Brian Cave. Okay. And I want you to go with Team Inquisition team tomorrow. I each goes team to the place where we saw that strange pattern. But I want you to be careful. Thank you. I won't let you down. Another thing. I have something I need to do, so I have to go out. You're in charge while I'm gone. As you wish. But that's where it stands. You two will be with me tomorrow. As such, Team Inquisition's non-guild members may not come. Brian Cave has a vicious foe lying in wait. You mustn't let your guard down. And don't do anything that keeps me from succeeding there. Okay, okay. You should go. You should go get ready. Let's go down to Treasure Town. Sure, but... I think we'll just do that off-screen and end it off here, actually. So, yeah. So thank you all for watching. Leave a like for this episode, and don't forget to subscribe and share with our friends. Once some people don't know, I shall see you in another episode. Watch next channel, man. Peace out.